I remember Jeff saying this was his favorite skin in the game to date. So, um, mercy in a bikini, anyone? Mercy in a bit. Oh my days. <clears throat> oh, oh, hey, hey guys, hi, uh, yeah. Um, <laughs> Well, this is embarrassing. Um, uh, welcome back to uh, the Monday show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, welcome back. Um, today, I felt like just checking out the uh, Summer game skins, seeing as I've got nothing else to do with my evening. <laughs> Lucio Ball. Oh, my days. I've been seeing it since day one of this game. What is up with the left nipple? You got, you got Hanzo. You got Genji. You got Doomfist now. I'm pretty sure one of the skins Anna had a nipple out too. I don't know, mate. I don't know. I could have been dreaming that. Maybe one of the designers who's designing these skins is actually missing their left nipple and they feel like they need to, like, attach it to the skins of their heroes to make themselves feel a little bit better about their lack of nipple. But where's the love for the right nipple? Where's the love? I'll tell you where the love is. It's attached to McCree, ladies and gentlemen. It is right there for everyone to see. My God, what a cracking nipple, McCree. What a cracker. What the fuck am I doing with my life? But it looks like we've got a little bit of a uh, injection of the skins here. And what I could see before me already is so, so good. So good. I know I say this when every other skin comes out, but these are pretty much already the best looking skins I think I've seen in the entire game. Widow, wow, you look hot. All right, just, just, just putting it out there. That looks, mm, mm, mm. McCree, my man. <laughs> you look hotter than Widow and Soldier, mate. <laughs> I can't, oh, look, let's just get into the skins because I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure there's going to be some other surprises. Anna, 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 yep. I missed. We're having fun. <laughs> Um, okay, so I've actually devised myself a little list of skins here to make life a little bit easier for myself Because usually we're traipsing through all of the skins and it takes forever to record this and it takes Fucking forever to edit it as well. The first skin I'm told is Junkrat So we're gonna check out Junkrat's skin here um, And I believe all seven of them are legendaries. That's what I've been told. We have none of this epic bullshit We all know the Aussies like a bit of old cricket <laughs> But let's see what Junkrat makes of it and <gasps> Ooh, that's weird. I like his little face mask thing. That's that's pretty interesting. He's got a little bomb like on his on his on his headband thing there. His little cap. His wheel is like it's a zip. Ooh. Oh, they're wickets. They're wickets. He's got wickets in there, and like poking out of his. What the fuck is this skin? Like obviously it's Australian colours. I totally get it. You know Australia, they love their cricket. You know I'm definitely getting the vibes there. I can feel that. Even though I personally do not like cricket at all. But his his body is like so... Eesh, it's so like elongated. Like look at him. He looks so like stretched out. Like <laughs> look at his waist. He's got literally the smallest ass I've seen on a human being. <laughs> Mate, I've seen fetuses with bigger asses than you. <laughs> Hashtag fetus porn is not a thing. His leg is actually a cricket bat. Look at that. Okay, that's probably the coolest thing about this skin. Uh, let's let's just check his weapon out a moment. Uh, it's green. I can say that it's got little cricket balls in there. That's pretty. That's pretty dishy. Dish, dish, dish. I don't know why I used the word dishy there, but oh well. We're gonna go with it. We're gonna roll with it, boys. Thirteen, unlucky number, I guess. And that looks pretty much the same with all the skins, anyway. Oh wait, let's check out his trap a moment. It's mine. Uh, where's his trap? And his trap's just green. Ah, oh, ah. Oh, they could have done something cool with that. But then I suppose it would have messed up because people might see it a little bit more. <laughs> Maybe he's like chucking down wickets or something. It's like, hang on a minute. Why is there a wicket sticking out of the ground? Bit suspicious that. But all in all, it's not a bad skin. I think it's okay. I wouldn't say it's one of those ones I'm going to rush out to, to the bank and get my money out and just start like spending it like some crazy man. I don't play junk rat a lot anyway at all. I just... But it's, it's one of them skins that I, I think, yeah, it's good, but it's, it's not enough to make me want to jump at it and go crazy like junkenstein was a cool skin it's different he has a different call out for his for his rip tire thing but even like uh even like the jester skins and the full skins I, I find them just more interesting i don't know let's uh let's move on to the next skin which is uh mccree 
Oh my goodness, I love it. I love it. I love it so much. It's definitely not got anything to do with the fact that McCree is half naked. All right, let me just put that... I'm not sure if I can. The V muscles are getting me all tingly. <laughs> is this gonna flip? No, no. Oh my days. Okay, so um, I got a big... <laughs> Thick as fuck flare gun that I'm gonna be shooting people with the the desert seagull. I think this is probably one of the better skins for McCree. I'm not gonna lie to you. I know he's bearing a lot of skin, and I know you know you're gonna call me gay or whatever, but I I don't I don't care about that. I think he looks good. All right, in a, in a sort of bro to bro manner. I'm not trying to you know start a thing with McCree, although. I could quite easily start a, <laughs> a thing with McCree. Um, oh, ew! Oh, McCree! How did I just know? Oh, look at his leg! He's got like the worst case of chicken leg syndrome I've ever seen. Look <laughs> at the size of his knees. Ew! His biceps are literally bigger than his legs. That's some, that's some imbalance. That is some total imbalance. You need to hit the gym and you need to hit that shit now. Fuck. <laughs> Oh, mate, the secret is out. No wonder he wore chaps the whole time. <sighs> Probably one of my favorite skins added to the entire game. And it's only been added a whole year and a bit past the game's release. Things get better with age. Let's just, let's just put it at that and leave it at that. Mercy, Mercy's got a skin. Let's check this one out. Uh, oh... The winged victory, lads. This could literally be anything. But I remember Jeff saying this was his favorite skin in the game to date. So, um, mercy in a bikini, anyone? Mercy in a bit. Oh my days. Not quite a bikini, lads, but showing off a good bit of leg. Oh my, she's a Greek goddess. She's a, she's. I need space. Okay, all right, I'm ready, I'm ready. I'm back in the game. Her hair is looking amazing. It's much tidier than the classic hair. The classic hair is like, pff, I do like messy hair, ladies. Just, you know, just gonna say that I like messy hair. But this, oh, she's even got the little, like, uh, the little reed things in her hair. <sighs> I can see why Jeff likes his skin so much. Even like the little things, like the fact that her, her wings are actually made out of feathers. Which seems like something you'd think, yeah, like, surely that would be a, a, a skin anyway. Like, who would not have thought of that until now? Like, surely they didn't just, like, oh, let's let's make her, her, her wings made out of feathers. And then some guy's like, oh, yeah, that's, that's a really good idea, mate. Well done, yeah, whoa. It will go perfectly with a golden weapon. You have a golden weapon on this skin, and you're like, yeah, look at me. I got my gold weapons. I got my medals. Kiss my ass. Even this, like, little rope thing here. Look at, oh, I love that. I need the Mercy skin, all right? I don't play Mercy. It's just so selfish of me. <laughs> but pick somebody who really wants Mercy, right? Take take, take that skin out of theirs and just plop it into my loot box. Does that sound good? Because I'm probably never going to play her, but that doesn't matter. I want to have the skin just to look at, boys. But even, like, the little gun, this, like, stupid little gun, it looks cool. It looks like a genuine gun. In, like, every other circumstance, the gun has been totally neglected as if it's not even in the game. I mean, look at this shit. Look at this shit. What is this? What is this? It's like this gun was not even meant to be in the game. It's just so, like, basic and crappy. And then they thought, you know what? Let's give it a bit of love. Let's give it some gold, eh? Can't go wrong with a bit of gold. It's like they've actually paid attention to parts of the skin that people might actually care about. And the, the staff, once again, looks nice. It looks, it looks good. It's, it's got these little things on it. It's supposed to, I suppose, resemble a torch or something. Nice. Very nice skin. Well done. Whoever created you, needs a raise. Jeff boy, get on that shit. Oh my god, it's a fucking dumb boy! <laughs> Moving on to Reaper then. We have a Reaper skin. That's a bit of a surprise. Wasn't expecting one from him. And it's the biker. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, wait, I know where this is from. I know where this is from. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let, let, let me just find this a moment. Let me just find this. There it is. The BMX. There he is. <laughs> Obviously, the skin's not the same, but you get the idea. One day, we're going to have the Reaper BMX bike race. Cross-country extreme. The orange, yellowy, fiery theme thing going on, but... 
it's it's not as heavily detailed as I was expecting. Look at the guns, for instance. They're pretty different, albeit, you know, they're, they're unique in their own little way, but they're not that detailed. Because if I were to switch back to El Blanco, for instance, which is another one of my favorite skins, look how detailed that is. You, you hold that in your hand and you feel like, you feel blessed. The biker is just not quite as detailed. Maybe someone couldn't be asked to do it, I don't know. But all in all, just, just, just get golden guns that look alright. I'm not a huge Reaper player anyway, so once again, I'm not all that into the skins, and I'm not like gagging, balls in hand, waiting to just like seminate all over the skin. Instead, I'm just sort of mildly impressed. I mean, yeah, he's got his skull and his cape, and yeah, it's an alright skin, and I think the Reaper mains probably like it, I, I guess. I, I don't know, I'm not a Reaper main, I, I can't really comment on that, but I wouldn't say it's his best skin. I wouldn't say it's his best skin. Good, but not quite the best. One to have, though. One, one, one to have in the kitty. Because I'm getting tired of looking at your face. We have a soldier. No. Not you, Roadhog. You get nothing. Initially, this was my favorite soldier skin. I was like, yeah, okay, this is a good one. You know, I'm happy with this. They only went and added on the Grill Master. Which has become my second favorite skin in the entire game. Ah, yeah, yeah, I'm not sure who brings a handgun to a barbecue, but I'm sure Mr. 76 could fill us in on that. Raising the stakes, lads. Okay, he's brought the knife. For what reason, I don't know. He's, he's got the spatula, the tongs. He's ready to, to, to cook and flip some burgers, lads. That's what we want, isn't it? We want some burgers, even though it's... Pissing it down with rain as I speak. He's sporting the hairy, scarred up legs, just like my dad's legs, you know? <laughs> just the fucking socks and the sandals, what the hell? Yeah, with the little the, the tea towel dishcloth thing. Oh, look! What the fuck? Let's just go ahead and check out the uh, Grill Master 5000. <laughs> Fuck it, I'll look at this thing. It's got like a, a gas canister on board. It got the, the, the temperature gauge. It's legitimately a flamethrower. And, and look, even the handle is like an oven mitt. And what, what does that say? Assault rifle. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I just, I don't know how this skin can get any better. I honestly, I, I love it. I, I love it so much. Even like that's going to be like a little temperature thingy. I, I know it is. <laughs> I mean, what's his little... No! No, 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 no. We got a barcode. Guys, guys. Sombra clues. To be used on emergency survivors only does not replace healthy lifestyle choices. What the fuck? <laughs> oh, man. Okay, okay. Let's just bring ourselves back to normality now and check out the Sombra skin, which is next on the list. The second to last skin, guys. We're getting through these. And it is the Tullum skin. In Ooh. Oh, she's like a deep sea diver. She's got her flippers. She's got her, her little, what was it, air canister thingies? I, I, I don't know. I'm not a diver. I <laughs> have no idea. Uh, she's got goggles, though. And look at her hair. Oh, mate. The hero's hair in this update has been on point. Mercy has, has had sexy hair. McCree with his blonde locks. Oh, come on, baby. Kind of looks deep sea divery with, like, the little, like, snorkel holes. And it's quite sort of like, like that thing looks like a fin, I guess. I don't really know what else to say about it. It, it. it looks wet. It's all this like weird thing up here that makes it look kind of juicy. Yeah. Yeah, that's 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 about all I have to say for that skin. But it's a nice skin. I'm not going to lie. It's a really cool skin. And uh, it would be nice to pick up that one nonetheless. Even though I don't play Sombra. At this point, you're probably thinking, well, Mundy, who the hell actually do you play? Who do you play in this game? Just tell us, man. Tell us. I'm a Zenyatta main, okay? It's hard being me. And the last skin on the roster is the Widow skin. And I'm hoping I can get through this quick because I'm running out of battery on my camera and I'm pretty much shitting my pants. And it is the Cote d'Azur. If that is how you pronounce that, I'm not French. But oh my goodness, that skin does not need to be French. It is hot. It is tattooed. Oh god, it is just downright sexy. I know I said the Talon skin is the best Widow skin, and I still stand by that. I think the Talon gun especially is one of the best uh, Widow guns, if not the best. And oh, oh, I just inadvertently skipped to the gun, but look at this thing. Wow. Um, it's got a bit of wood on it. It's like a sort of torch, like a tactical type thing. Uh, it says 
Beza Fatal? Is that Death Kiss or Widow's Kiss, I guess? It's a bit weird considering this is her skin, right? It's very summery. You know, she's got her sunglasses on that are going to flop down. You know, she's got high heels. She looks pretty good. I'm just going to put it out there. She looks good. Her gun, though, is so... It's a weird gun to have with that skin. It's almost like she should have like a water pistol gun or something that's the same sort of like bluey color or something. And then they're just like, nah, we're going to give it like a crazy commando thing. <laughs> it looks kind of cool, whatever. You know, I'll, I'll, I'll take it. But nonetheless, Widow skin, definitely one up there. Probably my new favorite Widow skin, not going to lie. The McCree skin, my god, favorite skin of the game so far without a question. The soldier skin, a close second with the mercy then coming in third. But that's just about it for today, guys. I really don't have anything else to show you. I've gone through all of the stuff that I wanted to have a look at and mess about with. Obviously, there's voice lines. Uh, there is a couple of uh, victory poses in the moats and stuff that have been added. But um, I'm just going to let you guys check that out. I know you might be asking yourself, Monday, why have you been wearing a hoodie this whole time? It's, it's summer, for Christ's sake. It's, it's summer, yeah, it's summer. Well, uh, don't mind me. I'm just warming up for a good game of Lucio Ball. Let's go! The worst case of chicken leg syndrome I've ever seen. Set my heart on fire.